Well, hello, folks. This is Bill with Bill Reddick Outdoors. And you know, if you've been sitting up in your deer stand for hours, sometimes things might get a little boring if there's not much activity going on in the woods. And that's where this modern technology comes in. You got buddies that's out in the woods hunting. You can text back and forth and stay quiet and not disturb your deer hunting and communicate with one another. And it helps a whole lot to pass the time on them slow days. Well, this particular day I'm thinking about, it was kind of one of them slow days. Uh, wasn't much going on. Not even a bird chirping. Y'all have heard me talk about my son-in-law, Josh, in my previous videos. It's about time y'all meet him. So I decided I would text Josh to see what's going on in his woods. And that way, he didn't have to make a whole lot of noise. He could stay quiet, and me and him could communicate and make the time go faster. This is the reply that I got. Well, we're coming to you via Video Wreck Outdoors here. Just a guest starring here on the channel. Uh, what we've done here is we've started out sweating this morning in the a.m. before we even climbed the tree. Okay, uh, yeah, this morning I was sweating and now I am freezing. I got a good feeling. Uh, Bambi's daddy is right behind that door. Go wait and see. Now, I love Josh to death, but he didn't have to jeopardize his hunt by making a bunch of racket and making videos, but he always goes above and beyond to try to do things for me. And even with him acting silly and carrying on in the woods and making all that racket, the boy still sees deer. Here's a couple of video clips that he sent me later that day. Well, folks, it's not always about just killing deer. Me and Josh both gets enjoyment out of just sitting and watching them. And just remember, whether you're at work or play, I hope you have a nice day. This is Bill Reddick Outdoors. See y'all.